Today, I want to speak about a recent photo that's been floating around social media of Philadelphia underboss Stevie Mazzone, another inmate, and Peter Pantuccio. In December 2015, Peter Pan and two of his friends set fire to a Mercedes in Howard Beach. Before committing this assault on a car, Peter Pan proved to be the genius that he's known to be by approaching the owner of the car and mentioned the name of a Gambino member who was looking to shake the guy down. As a further sign of his intelligence, he mentioned the Mercedes by saying, nice car. Nevertheless, in 2022, Peter Pan pled guilty to arson charges in exchange for a 10-year sentence. I personally find it amusing when people or Peter Pan himself labels him as true to Omerta. I remember one night while in Mateo's in Howard Beach. Joe Cafe, who's married to Peter Pan's mother's sister, specifically said the reason he would never propose him is that he took the test to become a police officer, following in the footsteps of his father. Had the NYPD accepted him into the academy and gave him that blue uniform, the second he slapped cuffs on someone, I guess Omerta would have been the last thing on his mind. Adding to this, the FBI agent who arrested Peter Pan for this crime told me that when he brought him in, he was acting like a scared rabbit, calling him sir, yes sir, no sir. In November 2020, Philadelphia underboss Stevie Mazzone was indicted in a racketeering case for illegal gambling, loan shocking, extortion, and drug trafficking. He pled guilty in June of 2022 to racketeering conspiracy, including extortion and illegal gambling. And in December 2022, he was sentenced to five years. Before he began serving his sentence, Peter Pan proudly announced on Instagram, Loretto, here I come. Loretto being the federal prison in Pennsylvania. To his delight and relief, Stevie Mazzone was classified for Loretto as well. According to former FBI counterintelligence special agent Joe Navarro, who's an expert on body language, nonverbal communication refers to body language. At times, body language can be more truthful than what we say verbally. Most of what we say is first processed consciously. Body language, conversely, is our bodies reacting to our thoughts. With that in mind, take a look at Stevie Mazzone's body language to Peter Pan. Mazzone is leaning into the unidentified inmate. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I'll end this with something I said a long time ago. If Peter Pan knew a light pole was straightened out, he'd be hanging around that light pole all the time. 